fuck. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the challenge. Your host, the most tomboy, double O, and your college tomboy TV. Welcome back to the challenge. You can see we're on the streets, not in New York, but of Jersey City, because your boy's here to pick up his pair. So, first off, to start off this video, we already got one loop down uh, the SB's UNC Air Jordan 1. So, I'm about to pick those up right now. I left my homie in the path train because it makes no sense for him to come out with me and then pay the fare again. I might as well just hop out and pick up my pair. We're coming from home. I know it's kind of confusing. I didn't really film the intro that well. But anyways, I'm going to head to the skate shop right now. I won the raffle. I'll show you guys a little bit in hand video as well. And then I'm hopping back on the path train, going to New York, and we're going to go run around. We're going to go back to Kith because last vlog, we went to Kith, but the line was too long, and the homies didn't really want to line up there. So we decided to not line up. Fuck, I'm out of breath, boys. All right, so we're literally one block away. I'm about to pick these up, as I said. And then we're also going to Pals, ch uh, chase some more leftovers. Kyrie sponge jobs also dropped today. We're gonna have a full review on that, so uh, more shit to come. Let's get it. 10 seconds later. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is also my first video with the AirPods on the iPhone, but we did secure two bags. So I did get the UNCs, the SB Jordan 1s in the size 11. I don't know what size I had because in the confirmation email for winning, they didn't exactly specify what size I got, but they also had the uh, white and the Game Royal SBs. You know, they're doing all right as well. Uh, let me see. Now, these prices aren't doing too well in the UNCs. are steadily going down because the full release is on Monday, August 12th. Many stores actually release them today. Uh, so we're going to see where prices go. About to head back on this train. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, so we still got the pairs. Uh, we're currently on Houston Street in the Soho area. Uh, we're about to to Kith right now because they did release the UNC Costins. This morning there, first come, first serve. Didn't even really announce it. Damn. But uh, we're gonna see if they still have them, and if not, we're gonna look around for the kit go close section, and hopefully get a bigger bag. We got these right here, the Defiance still sitting in most of the small ass size. Costings we did secure. Um, what else, we got the Game Royals, Cortez's, ooh, the PSG's there. Damn. I think we still got this flannel left here. Nice ass. It's only 145. This is the one that Harlem actually picked up before. 145. Then we got these, the long sleeves. Um, the shorts. The quality on these is different though. Definitely different pocket tees. Coca-Cola. These shorts are type nice though. Out of there, ladies and gentlemen. So they did have pairs, size so 11 and a half and up. Luckily they gave me a bigger bag. So we're about to head to Mercer. And I'll go you guys, I'll show you guys a little bit of a better look at the actual sneaker. Uh, because it's kind of getting hectic out here. I don't know why, but some shit's going down on the street. I will dodge. <laughs> Find a nice little place on Mercer. Actually on Howard, right across the street from Palace. So I'm going to show you guys exactly what we got. So first of all, we do have the Nike SBs, but not the ones you'd be expecting from today. This was actually at the skate shop in stock. Size 10 was the smallest size they had. Retail was 95. And, uh, these are they released a little while ago, but I did find them in there, so I was like, you know, I might as well pick them up. Nice little color. I love how they you got the little cracking going around. Quality overall is pretty decent. It does that does got that royal blue on the bottom. Of course, a little full unboxing coming at the end as well. And then we got two pairs of the UNCs, one I won the raffle on, the other one we did manage to pick up at Kith. So once again. The full entire view is coming home eventually, but these are popping very, very nicely. The full UNC colorway is looking very clean, but I'm not a Lowe's, Lowe's guy, so I will not be rocking these, but I'll show you guys them fully at the We finally left Mercer, and we linked up with the boy. <laughs> you already know. This is trash, bro. At Harlem Reseller, bro. Trash. What do we got today, yo? Trash. Oh, wait. Review coming soon, by the way. Full review. Yeah. We got all three of the highs. Two on the lows are coming soon. And this one. How would you say though? What would you wear the entire collection out of though? Uh, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like I said in the video, I wear these, but I can't even wear them because they run too narrow. Yeah. But if I'm gonna pick a pair for myself, it's these. These I give a six out of ten. These I give an eight out of ten. Yeah, not bad. And of course, you can see the same. No, I mean this is a fake flex by my part, but we still got the stickers uh, there for man. the authentic post. But uh, anyways, we're just chilling right now. We're gonna see what else we gotta do. I am picking up another pair of SBs. Not today's loop. I won't show you guys what it is. Well, for review, full review on that one is coming as well to the channel. I'll be reviewing that at home because it's a little bit easier than filming it out here in the city all the time. 
But as I said, we still got these secured. Well, look at the feats on the man today, bro. Air yeah, Max 90s, bro. Air Max 90s. Oh, it is. Yeah. And we got slides. That's it's all good. Comfort, comfort. I don't eat. I don't wear my products. Oh, you don't wear your products? Wear products? Why? Because investments. Because investments, right? Stupid. Stupid. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I don't wear my products. Everybody who sounds crazy, like yo, bro, how you got how you got 50 pairs of shoes, but you don't wear none? I'm like, bro, my 50 pairs of shoes is worth a lot of money. Stupid. Oh, That's right, bro. All right, so thank you guys so much. I mean, actually, we're gonna continue this vlog on to whatever else we do today. Might have to run round two or something because we did not go there yesterday. I'll catch you guys there. Yo, know, you gotta get loopy. You gotta get loopy on StockX. Let's see all these pairs, bro. Can I get out of this shit, bro? Oh, oh, dang, bro, dang, bro. Oh, you can barely see. What are you looking on? What are you looking on today? What's the real loop? What the fuck are you spelling, buddy? Oh, I'm, bro, I'm so slow. <laughs> what the no, fuck? The fuck? It's not me, it's the keypad. What the fuck? Whoa, 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 what are you spelling, bro? What are you spelling, bro? <laughs> bro, what's up with this keypad, bro? <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. Yeah, you got it. There you go. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yo. Uh oh. Yo. Is it out of that alone? Yeah, I'm Oh, the typical error. What a great promo. Not for me, so. What is it? Oh, fucking clever. Yeah. Yeah. You got this one, don't you? Yeah, Damn, he's going up, bro. This is shit. I know, this Yo, 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 yo. Fuck Supreme. Fuck Supreme, dude. I'm an ape. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Them now, so fuck with me. I can't find no thotties. No, nah, yeah, got different naps. Time and give me knowledge, y'all. Right, come get mileage. Gentlemen, so we just got out of the Apple store. We, I did finish up on the video, the live cop from the actual kith and uh, what drop palace palace autumn 2019, which was actually successful. Right now, we headed to Flight Club, which is basically where we're gonna drop off the pairs from Goat that the homie sold over there. Yeah, yeah, quick drop off. You know, I still got mine. And these have one secret item, the other SBs, and two pairs of the UNCs. So I'm gonna unbox that for you guys when I get home. Because that's all the pickups from today. And the rest of it will be done on a separate review. So we better get into Flight Club and see what they got. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we just got out of Flight Club. It was quite a long time to actually sell them, but we finally finished it off. Love you guys can see right there, bro. We got the little Travis Scotts. Ooh, you know those doing the hot. But right now we're just gonna chill for a bit. I might end up selling one pair on GOAT. Not too sure yet. I was gonna hold them, but then again, they do come out on sneakers, so I'm gonna debate it right now, and then we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do. And we are back home, ladies and gentlemen. Now, unfortunately, your boy's a dumbass. So, uh, <laughs> today was a great day. I mean, today in the video day was a great day. Today itself is like 2 p.m. I mean, not 2 p.m., it's 1 p.m. right now. Uh, I'm finishing up this video because I forgot to finish it off. And then, of course, my dumbass got too hyped on the UNCs. I sold them, right? I sold them for the high, bro. The buyer must pay the high. Luckily, they did sell on GOAT for $275 a p Nah, 275 one pair. Other pair sold for like around two. Uh, I sold that one a little bit low, but 275 one was a good one right there on GOAT. That's why I recommend always selling on GOAT. But unfortunately, that means I do not have the pair for you guys today because I did decide to drop it off at Flight Club. And what ended up happening after I dropped it off at Flight Club, I get an extra five bucks. And I was like, as I was dropping off, I was like, what the fuck? I didn't do the review for the YouTube. It is what it is, bros. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. But I do have the rest of the shoes to unbox because those weren't the only SBs that I did pick up that day because we did go to a few skate stores and there were a good amount of pretty decent shoes. Now, here we go into the first one. I do want to get straight into it because I'm sure... I don't know how long this vlog was. I don't think it was that long. But I hope you guys enjoy the most of it. Uh, this is the Nike SB Pro RPM White. Uh, this is the... Oh, yeah. This is the Galoop. Now, I might have to burn my own loop right here for you guys. But... It is what it is, right? These SBs right here are flipping for the super high. And they don't have a lot of hype to them. A lot of people don't even know about them. But I got to say right here, bro. These Nike SBs, these are called the white game royals. They got the game royal bottoms. They're, they got like the cr First of all, I'd love to rock these if I could, if I really liked this. I mean, I love SB Dunk Lows, but not to an extent that... I don't know how they really fit on me. They don't really fit me that well. But they got the cracked leather on it, bro. That's just magnificent. I, I love this shoe right here, though. The design overall is wonderful. I wouldn't wear it myself, though. 
Um, I don't know why. I'm just not a big SB, like, on feet type of guy. I love, love, love the way they look. Just on feet on me, they just don't look that good. And also, I feel a little disrespectful to the OGs, you know. Sorry, I got to step away from your SBs out here. But we do have the game roll bottoms, and the only game roll other aspects are on the tongue right here. Now, this one is $95 retail, and it's currently selling for, like, $170, bro. Size 8s are going for, like, fucking $300, bro. And barely people know about this loop, but it is what it is. Comes with blue laces right here. Smaller sizes, the better. Most skate shops probably only have bigger sizes left but i managed to get a size 10 and i'm ecstatic on it we got the nike sb box right there the tag and then this is what it is a pretty good dunk day i gotta say a lot of sbs i'm pretty satisfied on this pair right here we'll put that right there so that's cop number one then we're going to well this isn't really a cop because uh i'm fake flexing this pair right here <laughs> Because I was on vacation when these dropped. Now, I do, will not unbox it. I will not be doing a review right here. I'll do, be doing the review separately. But we do have the Nike SB pairs. I do want to show you guys real quick what we're working with right here. Shout out to Harlem Reseller right now. This shoe is probably one of my favorite SBs to drop of this year. And if not, the past year. And continuing off on that point, my apologies, the camera did die out, but these are the pairs once again. I gotta say, they killed it on the swoosh, the multi layering swoosh all around. Full review coming on that, as well as the uh, gift that it, not really gift, but with the extra shit it came with. But next SB, we got like four pairs of SBs right here, not gonna lie. Actually, I'm gonna just open up this one right here, because it's basically just another pair of the shoe you guys already seen, except it's a size 10.5. Now, this size isn't really selling for that great, but uh, it is what it is. I'll take it like $25 here and there. It does add up over time. The same exact sneaker, the Nike SB Game Royal on bottom, and you got the Zoom Air insult on the inside. Now, I do like these once again, but uh, I would check your local skate shops. They do have them. Please don't be undercutting. Please don't be burning burning the market right here because uh, that's not what we need at all but the last nike sb pickup i did want to show you guys i did pick up was actually from oh the box a little bit damaged that's tragic let's fix that real quick as you can see right there but this is a nike sp zoom blazer low gtqs now i did find these on sale for only 65 dollars these are a size 11 and boys check the market on these size 11 bro size 11 is actually doing really really well we got the polar uh on the back of this shoe embroidered it looks to be stitched on we got the leather swoosh on the sides then we got the nike uh, swoosh with the i don't even know what that logo is but i know this was a collab with another brand i honestly don't know much about this shoe uh i know it did release this polar one and then it released another polar 180 or something like that it was like a different type of skate shoe it was like a high mid top if i'm not mistaken but these are the blazers and they're actually doing pretty decently on their oh what the hell these are dirty bro they sold me the dirty item Damn, they sold me the dirty item. No way. Damn, they sold me the dirty item. How can they do this to me? Wow, that's fucked. Look, yeah, all right. That looks like it looks like some scuff marks on these, but they don't look worn at all. You guys can look at the bottom. They don't look like they're worn at all. But yeah, that's some sad shit right there. All right, I'm going to have to clean those up a bit, but they do come with the white laces as well. It is what it is. Skate stores be, uh, you know, skate stores, you know, they be sometimes wearing their shit, sometimes not. It be like that sometimes, you know what I mean? But anyways, that's it for these. I know, like, these are going for, like, $150 right here, so it's not a bad loop. $65 retail. Not bad at all. So anyways, that's it for Host the Most. Hope you guys enjoy. Now, those, some are from uh, the other skate shop and some are from others, just, you know, different ones around the area. Hope you guys enjoy, though. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the pair review and all the good stuff coming. Please subscribe to the channel. I appreciate it so much. Peace.